Okay, so the last thing I wanna discuss is acid rain. So here I have a marble statue, all right? Picture was taken, and then a picture was taken years later after it had been rained on a whole bunch with rain that was acidic. So why does this happen? Well, if I have acidic rain, I'm gonna have H plus ions, okay? And what is marble? It's calcium carbonate. Okay, well, when that happens, what's gonna form? Well, I'm gonna get some calcium ions and I'm gonna get carbonic acid. Well, remember, we learned that carbonic acid is not stable. This actually does not form. So what actually forms instead? Well, we still get those calcium ions, but what we get is water which washes away, and carbon dioxide gas, which bubbles off. And so rain that's acidic is going to cause this erosion. Um, obviously, the more acidic the rain, the more protons that are there that can react with the calcium carbonate, and the faster that our marble is going to erode. Another consequence of rain that's acidic is uh, your car's paint. So there's four layers. You've got your body panel, your substrate, your base coat, and then a really thick clear coat, which is supposed to, you know, protect your paint job because your base coat, that's the color of your car. Well, different things will happen. Things get stained, things oxidize, you can scratch, but we also get etching by acid rain. Acid rain will eat away at the clear coat. This is why if you have a paint job and a bird poops on your vehicle, it can eat away at your paint because bird poop is highly acidic. And so having it sit there, the longer it sits there, the more it can eat away at your paint. In fact, if you have to get your car repainted, they give you a warning and tell you do not park under any trees um, while your car has been freshly painted because the clear coat actually takes a really long time to dry and cure. When they give you your car back after a paint job, it's actually not done yet. And so while that clear coat is still curing, it is even more susceptible to reacting with acid and you can really get a number done on your paint job. Um, I had a car that this happened to. I had been in an accident. A lady hit me um, coming out of a Starbucks driveway, not paying attention to what she was doing. And my entire car had to be repainted. Right after I got my car back, I went on a vacation well, not really a vacation, just a trip to see friends um, up north. And my car was at my parents' house. They decided to move it. They pulled it up under a tree. And by the time I got back, there were two splotches on my vehicle that when I finally washed my vehicle, there was discoloration there. And that never went away because uh, birds pooped on it right after I had gotten it painted. So super fun. And with that anecdote, that ends the video lectures for Chem 120. You have survived all of the lecture material that goes with this course. You should be proud of yourself.